My goal is to harness our innate immune system to fight cancer. We all know that our immune system is powerful when we have flu, when we have a cold. The immune system needs a little gentle nudge to fight cancer, and we're trying to find the right recipe to do that. I'm Lin Yin Li, a professor of biochemistry at Stanford University and also a core investigator at the Art Institute. This is why my research matters. When I was 30 years old, I started losing my energy and I started being forgetful. I was diagnosed with breast cancer. And brain fog is a very first symptom of many cancer patients. I chose the most aggressive surgery. At that time, I didn't know how much time I had. So I thought to myself, okay, I probably got 10 years before my cancer comes back. That's going to be my wrong way. So I sharply focused my own research on cancer research. Immunotherapy has transformed how cancer patients are treated. Our lab uses drug-like molecules to activate our innate immune system so that our immune system knows the cancer cells are there, T cells would come in, specifically kill the cancer cells, just like how they would normally kill any virally infected cells. This is ultimate solution for a cure. After 10 years of research, we have found the key molecule that primes our immune system to warn that breast cancers are there, prostate cancers are there, pancreatic cancer, glioblastoma, the tumors that typically are really good at disguising themselves from our immune system. To me, to succeed is to fail faster. For industry, you don't have the freedom of publication, you don't have the freedom of sharing your research, and oftentimes when a project fails, no one knows. Academia has its uh, unique place in uh, pushing science forward. You haven't hit the goal until you have treated the disease. We don't just succeed in a dish, in a lab, although um, this is where all the discoveries begin. We only succeed when I read these reports of patients who are cured.